lately I've been thinking about a lie now You don't never know until you find out I said to myself, it's me, myself and I I can't really be with all that rah rah. No, I ain't never been with all that rah rah. My mind on the money, smoking Zaza. Hey, there's love to run, they mouth, they be like blah blah. I can't really be with all that rah rah. Hey, turn me up, gotta get in my zone. You just want to. How you living? How you living? How you living? This is Broccoli Sasuke, and it's another episode of Cryptocurrency News in 2021. So recently I did a video on NFTs, which is non-fungible tokens, and about, you know, looking at other videos <clears throat> about how you can make profit off of it and how, um, I don't know, I think it was a pretty good investment. So I was wondering, how do you... Uh, how do you get a, a NFT? Like what? Like do you use Google Play? So I did some research and I couldn't find none. So I was like, okay. So recently I seen an article about uh, NBA how they were implementing um, NFT. So we're gonna go and dive into that right now. So it's called Top Shot. Wait, okay. Maybe should go. Let me go into the first one first. <laughs> Let me go to the second one first. That's what I meant to say. So, okay. Maybe the first one. Okay. All right. All right. So, basically, NBA Hotshot is the latest NFT power crypto collectibles craze. Want to buy it? You know, your favorite base basketball moments and own it forever. And this is how. Oh, I guess I do have. Get the decrypt app. Eh. Anyway, I, I didn't know about that, but anyway, so Top Shot is like the last crypto thing. So basically, NFTs is like like cryptocurrency, except unlike Bitcoin, where you can break it down into individual pieces called satoshis. It's just one long blockchain, and 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 that's the thing that makes it so much more valuable because with Bitcoin. You know, there's so there's 21, was it 21 million in existence? You know, but when you have something such as uh, NFT, there can only be one in existence, only one to ever be made, and that could make it so much more profitable than you know uh, Bitcoin or, or any other cryptocurrency. So I could see that as a mar uh, emerging market, especially like with art. You know, art being digital, so. Wow. Anyway, I go on that. So, special type of cryptocurrency. So, yeah. And who is it? Last loan, people, 100,000 people uh, purchased NBA Top Shot moments. Crypto Clam. So, basically, basically it's like a, a, a high-tech uh, basketball card uh, system. Shit. You know what I mean? And then this is some more information about it. Uh, so millions of dollars are changing hands over virtual uh, cars and boom, boom and burst as always. Let me see. Uh, I just spread that out. Oops, my bad. Let me put this back. So how y'all living? Y'all doing okay? Uh, so in the comments, you know, uh, tell me in the comments what I, I could be doing better or worse or, or anything. So anyway, we're going to go back into this article. So millions of dollars are changing hands over virtual. Like, and that's serious because, like, when I was on, uh, when I was on a website, I mean, you see a deal, a, a trade that's going for fifteen dollars, like or whatnot, and you put your order in and say, "Oops, order's been filled," because it's like a hot cake. So it's like, dang, I, I, I see what they mean. They change their hands. It's, it's a lot of money going on, on a website. Okay, let's keep going on. Let's keep going on. Anyway. So anyway, I thought it was a good idea. 
and I and I and I was like, okay, let me go invest. And since I'm from Memphis, you know that's where I'm from. You know I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna represent. So this is <laughs> so okay. This is fun. Okay, this is funny. So when you sign on, you know you you sign on an account. You uh you sign on with a Dapper uh on the Dapper blockchain, and they give you an auto generated like username. So, bro, look at what bro, bro, look at this. Look at like look at this. <laughs> Owned by F Homely Flamingo twenty thirty four. <laughs> like dog, like the most, the most. Alpha masculine sport out there, right? You know what I'm saying? Aggressive, cause you know to be uh, uh, LeBron James, man, you gotta be, you gotta be in the paint, you gotta work, man. And then they'll auto generate a name called Homely Flamingo. <laughs> I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't know. It's not, 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 I mean, not the same thing. I just find it really, really funny. Like I thought it'd be something more masculine, like. Like uh, you know, Bandit Twenty Twenty or uh, I don't know, uh, Monster Truck, uh, Yu Gi Oh, Fighters Twenty Two. I don't know. I I really don't know. But you get the point. So I changed my name uh back to my original name. What it is? What it is? Oh shoot! Flip that! Flip that! Flip that! Flip that! Ah, it is Broccoli Sasuke. Sasuke Broccoli. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so anyway, I invested uh, $19 and um, I'm just going to hold and see. And who, who is he? What's his name? What's his name? What is his name? Honestly. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's a it's a grizzly player. If you, if anyone knows in the comment section who this is, shout out or, or let me know. Cause I, I'm I can't wait till they start getting MMA, and cause I'm a big MMA fan. You know, with Silver uh, is is one of my biggest. You know, is I'm his biggest fan. Also with uh you know Mayweather and I, oh my oh my goodness, I can't wait till UFC gets in it. But meanwhile, NBA is pretty cool. NBA is pretty cool, so we'll we'll see. I got a a nineteen dollar a token, and see how much it appreciates in value. If it if it goes up, if if I get it from nineteen dollars, I'm gonna try to see if I if I goes to sixty dollars, I'm selling it. Gone, man. Y'all can have it. Matter of fact, if y'all want it right now for sixty dollars, <laughs> I can have it. Leave, leave leave it in uh leave it down in the comment section. If y'all really want this uh collectible, shit, I sell it. All right, news of the weird. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go build this up real quick. Build this up real quick. Uh. Oh. Hey, uh, hey, uh, hey! Uh. I want to be a new dance of twenty twenty one. I, I really do. I just, I hope it ain't gonna be nothing crazy. But I'm like spinning on my head and some, some stuff like that, cause, you know, I, I ain't as, uh, I ain't young spring chicken like I used to be. Uh, okay, let me get that situated. YouTube. So, I was just randomly scrolling on YouTube. Well. Not just YouTube. But I was scrolling on my uh, time page, and I seen something in India about this. It's really unfortunate. This young teen, uh, young uh, girl, she died from uh, a monkey attack in in India. And at first glance, you'd be like a monkey, something that's so small. You like like no offense, no offense. As American, I have. No, ex no experience with monkeys, you know, outside of from being the zoo. So, what you see on TV and the media, you think they're like cute and cuddly, and that you can just bully them, but absolutely not. So, I, I did some research, 
And I was like, I was like, is this is this like a freak accident? But honestly, it's not even that uncommon. Which, which, I want to show some people context about how dangerous, like monkeys in India can be. I mean, I was like, wow. We match all the cash back you've earned at the end of your first year. Uh, okay, okay. So look at this, like, so look at this. Oh, there he comes. Oh, shit. God dang. Shit. <laughs> That's like a uh. That's like a uh, a, a, a pit bull mixed with a spider, man. I'm telling you. God damn, that's four of them. Wow. Wow. Now that that's some scary stuff. Man, ain't nobody got time for that, man. Shit, okay. ain't, no, ain't nobody got time for that, bro. Bro, ain't nobody. And, and you feet. Oh my. That, see, that's the problem. Okay. All right. All right. That is the problem right there. That guy. You uh. You probably one that probably caused a whole all all this uh accidents. Uh uh. That's the problem right there. I didn't I didn't notice that the first time around, but now looking back. This man might be a super villain raising some um, freaking uh, army of killer monkeys. I don't know. I don't know, but that really is suspect. I didn't notice that before. They not they not even messing with this guy. Yo, this man might be a low key super villain. Okay, but anyway, dang, that would be a nice hustle though, bro. Like honestly. You got a band of kill. Okay, stop. <clears throat> anyway, I'm sorry I went off on that tangent, but uh, yeah, I, I really do feel like uh, NFTs and NBA hot shots gonna be a uh, a big thing. Um, and it's just a matter of time before athletes start negotiating. Deals for their own NFTs because I'm not sure who really owns NFTs. Is the NBA or is the athletes? Like, what's the negotiations going on with this? It's such an emerging market. It's it's no telling what's going to go right now. But um, let me know um, about NBA High Shot. Do you think it's a good thing to um, to invest in? Are you invested in it or is it not? Um, with that being said, man. Oh, no. So, what you think about the monkeys in any? That's 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 crazy. Those those like seriously. Anyway, let me know uh, what you think about it. Um, and that's me. Y'all stay blessed. And I'm out.